Hey everyone, and welcome back to Fast Facts. Now, we can all probably agree that space travel has got to be one of the most rewarding and fulfilling jobs in the world. But have you ever thought about all the possible harm space travel can have on an astronaut's body? In today's video, we're sharing five health complications that can occur in space. Now, obviously, there are many more, but today's are just going to cover five for your fast facts for the day. Number one, did you know that bone tissue diminishes about one to two percent per month in space? To give some perspective, that is how much an elderly woman or man loses in one month. So as you can see, for a healthy young adult, that is quite a drop in bone density. Number two, it isn't just bones that seem to waste away when in space. Muscles can quickly diminish without exercise. In fact, an astronaut can lose up to 20% of muscle mass in anywhere between five to 11 days in space. In order to prevent this, most astronauts do resistance-based workouts every day for about two hours. Studies have shown that if they exercise, they can hold off the bone loss and muscle decline. Number three, when it comes to the human heart in space, not only does it get weaker, but it gets smaller too. Which if you remember from our last video on the body, the heart is already an extremely small size. This happens to the heart due to the lack of gravity working against it. So it doesn't have to work as hard and leaves astronauts with a lack of aerobic capability. Number four, did you know the first couple days in space cause astronauts to feel very sick due to the weightlessness? This is known as space adaptation syndrome. As a result of this syndrome, their vestibular system located in the inner ear, which controls balance, gets out of whack and confused. Last fact of the day is an astronaut's spine can stretch approximately 3% when in space. Due to the lack of compressive load, the spine actually stretches. Although astronauts may gain an inch or two in height, they also face serious back problems. Well, that sums up this episode of Fast Facts. We hope you learned something new and we will catch you all in the next one.